Hello, Felicity! And hello, everybody! Guess what, you guys? I have been grinding it out, trying to get to level 40, but it's been more than six hours today, and I'm just, you know what? Let's just go right ahead. We got 37 levels. We can get at least a few more things. Felicity, please do not shove. But, um, we can get a few more things enchanted today, but, uh, I, um, I was mining for so long, it's now spring! So we can take off our big bulky pea coat and get to work. Excuse me, Fel 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 Felicity. Okay, no. Okay, one of us is going to take damage. Who do you- It's gonna be you. Okay. That works for me. Hello, all the doggies. I still have to have a little bit of time, you guys, to um, create custom textures for all the dogs, but uh, we will get to that. So, let's do our normal thing and check the season's clock. As you can see, it is very firmly transitioning from winter into spring. I actually think that um, some of our crops should be almost ready for us to harvest them again because now it is, wow, that um, hemp is, is quite tall. Um, but yeah, so, I mean, as you can see, in the fence, as you can see, boom, our first tea leaf harvest of the year. Uh, what else is ready? Ooh, the, oh, come back here. The asparagus, don't, okay, good. The asparagus is ready. Oh, not all of it, but some of it definitely is ready. What is this? What are, what are you? What is you? Not ready, that's what it is. Uh, and then what is this? Ooh, we have more rhubarb. Excellent, we need to get into making some pies. Ooh, what is this? Oh, leeks, we've got plenty of leeks now. Not that we needed any more leeks, we, we don't particularly use them a lot. I think these are scallions, yeah, we have scallions as well. I can't, ooh, more peas, excellent. I can't believe that we are already back into spring, you guys. That is just mind boggling, oh my gosh. But yeah, we have broccoli now. Uh, what else is going on over here? Ooh, sweet potatoes, excellent. Uh, carrots, more carrots, and the potatoes are not quite ready yet. Hello, little kiwi bird. You are not welcome into my garden. I am very sorry, but the food that I grow is for me and for Felicity and for the animals. Okay, doop, doo, doo, doo. And so, you guys, what I have been doing in order to kind of uh, hopefully. Um, so, we need to come over here now to our little super smelter. I made a few adjustments to it. As you can see, I actually took out the hoppers because I want to be able to actually get all, ooh, we're up to 38 now. Correct me if I'm wrong. You only get the experience if you take the item, the smelted item out of the furnace. Is that correct? I don't, I don't really know. So please let me know in the comments down below if you know the answer to that, but I was finding I wasn't getting the experience. So I just had to go ahead and remove the hoppers that were right back in here. And then I was started getting all of the, the experience that I needed. So we are up to 38 now. And yes, as you can see, there are some random animals in here. Those are all of the, um, male, the, uh, the uh, rams and the bucks and what's not the male uh, version of all of the animals that we have because we had a little bit of a, a, a goat explosion, a sheep explosion. We had so, so many animals, so many animals. So uh, I had to go ahead, I had to remove a few of the animals. <clears throat> they are now in our refrigerator. But I mean, as you can see, we still have a lot a lot of goats, a lot of sheep, and then our same number of cows. Also, you might have noticed in my inventory, milk. Uh, I definitely want to go ahead and start making some cheeses. I think maybe if we even create like a little dairy barn maybe, and have high horses, and um, put like a whole bunch of <sighs> animals, animals everywhere, and then, no, no, stop. <sighs> Okay, what was I saying? That's right. Um, I was saying that we should create like a cute little dairy. Oh my, oh my, animals! Animals, please. Um, we should create a cute little dairy barn and then have like all our little cheese molds and like little cheese making stuff in there. I just think that would be super, super cute, you guys. And now I have to get out of this corner. I am being a cost, what, what, you what? You want wheat? Is, is it the wheat that you are, that you desire? Because I have the wheat. 
I have a lot of the wheat. Here you go. Wheat for everybody. Oh my gosh, this was a bad idea. Okay, wheat, wheat for everybody. Make it rain wheat. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness gracious. Hello, everybody. Wheat, 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 wheat. Yes, all of the wheat everywhere. So now that we have fed all of the animals, let's come up here and hopefully get um a few enchants done. That was kind of another thing that I really, really wanted to do today. But um, as you can see, I actually created for myself another diamond pickaxe. So I got the enchant for efficiency four on it, you guys. And then when I did the enchant for efficiency, C4, I got Unbreaking 3 on it as well. Literally amazing. I did that because I didn't really want to keep using my, I didn't really want to use my Silk Touch pickaxe just for regular everyday mining, you know? So the Silk Touch pickaxe is safely stored in our house and now we have this brand new, uh, just regular basic mining pickaxe. But I can't believe the sun's already going down. <laughs> There's never enough time in the days in Homestead. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, so let's come over here to our enchanting area. What have we reading? Really? Reading. A level 30 enchant. <sighs> well, I guess we can just do power one just to kind of cycle through the enchants that are available. And then let's come in here and try this again. Okay, what have we got? got oh, we got a sharpness three, sharpness two, and projectile. So we have sharpness three. If we did another sharpness three, we'd get sharpness four, but do we really need sharpness four? I really would prefer looting. That would really be ideal. So, okay, let's cycle through it again. One more book spent. Okay, so we have looting two. I mean, I really would have liked looting three, uh, but maybe if we get two looting twos, Oh, I don't, uh, 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 okay, sure. And let's cross our fingers we can get another looting enchant. But it is officially nighttime, so let's come over here, let's sleep, and then in the morning, let's go and, I don't know, I might make another diamond sword because I actually, hello Felicity, I need to build you a house, don't I? Or do you enjoy staying in my loft with me? What do you want to do, Felici Felicity? My goodness, words. Okay, um, Oh, okay. I should be thrown in a dungeon, apparently. Well, that's no way to thank somebody who's been putting you up in their house for an entire winter. Rude. Okay, so hello, doggies. Maybe she doesn't like dogs. I don't know, you guys. If she doesn't like dogs, then she definitely cannot stay here. But I think let's go, let's make ourselves uh, maybe a few more diamond tools. Then we can always just combine said diamond tools. So another sword. And then one, two, three, another pickaxe, and then one, two, one, okay. Let's go ahead and let's do all of that. Create the another pick, boom, and then create another sword. Alrighty, here we go. Knock back and smite and knock back. Trash. Okay, <laughs> let's try the pickaxe. <gasps> Ooh. Fortune three, yes, please. Okay, so we will definitely be combining the unbreaking, the efficiency, and oh, oh my, oh, oh my god, we got two bonus enchantments on that. Are you kidding me? We got an unbreaking three, we got a fortune three. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys, if we combine them, I'd have to repair this one, I think, first. I don't know, we'll figure it out, you guys. Oh my gosh, what luck. <laughs> Okay, that's gonna be a pretty amazing pickaxe. Let's see what we can get on the sword again. Um, sweeping edge, sweeping edge, sharpness. Ugh, no. Okay, let's try a book, maybe. So, fortune, protection. Wait, did we already get... No, we got looting. We want looting. Focus, table, focus. Okay, we want we want looting, and there is no looting, so we're just gonna have to hard pass and all those other enchantments, and uh, we'll have to just we'll just keep let's just put this in here, but uh, we'll keep working on it definitely, and uh, maybe eventually we will get all of the enchants that we want, but I think for right now, let's go over here and let's definitely go and combine these two pickaxes. So now we have our silk touch pickaxe and now we have our fortune and loot you know fortune unbreaking and efficiency pickaxe all the enchants you guys all of the enchants 
Alrighty, there we go. Pickaxe number one, pickaxe number two. So it's going to be uh, Unbreaking three, Efficiency five, Fortune three, Pickaxe. Shouldn't it be? Shouldn't. No, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, Unbreaking three, Unbreaking three. Shouldn't we get a higher tier of Unbreaking? I guess not. Okay, sure. But at least it is going to be 100% healed. And now for a name for this totally awesome and amazing pickaxe. Oh my god, okay. I don't... <laughs> Maybe this isn't a good name. Maybe it is. I don't really know you guys, but I think I want to name our pickaxe Cobble Gobble. Because it like gobbles the I don't know. <laughs> Why? Why am I so lame? Oh my god. But there it is. The Cobble Gobble. <laughs> I don't even know if I spelled that right. <laughs> I just, I have tears in my eyes. Oh, why? Why am I like this? Oh my god. Okay, you guys. So we have our sword that we need to name. Then we have Winter Guardian. And we have Cobble Gobble. Why? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, give me a moment. I just, this shouldn't even be that funny. It really shouldn't. <laughs> I've just had such a long day that it's just like the cup of cup. Oh god. Right, well there we go, you guys. We have got our brand new, awesome, and amazing pickaxe, the Cobble Gobble. And, oh, I can't say that with a straight face, no. Okay, so yeah, so we have this pickaxe, which, which was the one we originally made, which was, which, blah, 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 which was just an efficiency and a silk touch pickaxe. This is just our special pickaxe, like if we find pods or anything that we need to mine up with silk touch. But uh, the Cobble Gobble, We'll be handling everything else. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Alrighty, you guys. So first thing we need to do this morning is we need to go over and get one of our roosters. I'm not exactly sure what happened. I think something must have gotten in with our chickens because if you remember, we had like maybe six of the leghorn chickens and then like three or four of the brown chickens. We only have four chickens left, you guys, so we definitely need to bring over one of the roosters. And um, yeah, let's bring over you. Come on, buddy, let's go. You about to have some little baby chicks. Come on, come on, little rooster. But yeah, so we're gonna be bringing a rooster over and um, hopefully um, kind of reviving our chicken population. We had a whole, oh, hello, peacock. Would you like in? Um, come on, you can come in. There you go. Yeah, I know. You make the most annoying noises, but you are, but you are very pretty. But there we go, you guys. Mr. Rooster is over here, and hopefully we'll be seeing a few little baby chicks. Because as you can see, we have two white roosters. I mean, two, two white of the leghorn hens, and then two of the brown hens, and that is, oh, our first baby. Chick. Oh my goodness, look at you, you're so cute. Let's pick you up. Oh my gosh, it's cute. As I was saying, so I think I might want to actually do fruit trees here and vineyard here as well. Because then the vineyard would be really nice and close to our house. Yeah, I think that would actually be great. And then maybe like over, like we can clear a little bit of space, maybe like back in the woods, like in the all the tall trees back there to put the fall autumn area. I don't know, I don't know you guys. Okay, I'm gonna go. I, I might even have to go into creative to fly around and look at our area. It just, uh, yeah. That might be something I want to do. I don't know. <sighs> probably. Probably. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's a sable. I, I am in creative, you guys. Just because I wanted to fly overhead and uh, look at everything we have going on with our property right now. So, okay. I definitely think I'm going to put the vineyard, the vineyard over there now. And then uh, go ahead and like clear out this whole back area here, I think, to put the whole like autumn area. So I think that is, I think that's for the best because I mean, I, I have a feeling with all the fruit trees and with the building and everything, we're gonna need a little bit more room than what just behind our house can provide. So I definitely think uh, right about here is where I'm going to start working on the vineyard. I just have to decide now if I want the vineyard 
closer to the water, like here, and then have the fruit trees back in here, or if I want the vineyard back in here and fruit trees up here. Decisions. Big, big decisions to be made. But you guys, I think that is actually going to be it for today's episode of Homestead. I have a lot that I want to get done. I will probably film maybe a little bit of a time lapse of me building the vineyard just so you guys can kind of see. Uh, I didn't really do that for the stable just because I didn't really know that I was really going to be building a stable until I built the stable. And then for the next episode, I have something special that I'm going to try to do with you guys because I have a feeling we're probably going to be getting close to summer again at that point. Honestly, these day the, the days, they just go by so fast on Homestead. So I have a little special something something that I think I'm going to want to kind of do for the next episode so if you want to make sure that you see that please be sure to subscribe to my channel and if you enjoyed this episode please leave a like on the video it really does help me out and I really do appreciate it you guys all the support that you give this series is just absolutely amazing and I will see you guys in the next episode of Homestead where we need to start naming some of our animals I need to get some more levels and we need to name a lot of our animals you guys but uh until then and goodbye.